us at Remote Winbox, and here's what's new for August 2023. Let's begin with our new addition to two-factor authentication. If you prefer to get your authentication code as a text message instead of an email, enable SMS in the profile of the dashboard and be sure to have your cell phone number updated. Next up, you may have noticed we added interactive help guides to the dashboard to help new users. These guides can always be selected under the help profile and they just lead you through a few of the features that might be helpful when getting started in Remote Winbox. Another new feature we released this month was our bulk user invite. You can find this feature under the user manager, subscribers, and simply click the manage routers to see a listing of all of your routers that you can then invite the end user to. It's quick and easy to give access and then they'll, the subscriber will see it in their end user dashboard. If you've logged into the dashboard recently, you may have noticed some new alerts. The engineers at Remote Winbox recently added monitoring and alerting for SFP light levels, PoE voltages, speed and duplex, and more. This is still a work in progress, but the goal is to alert network administrators to problems on the network. If you haven't seen our microfiber case study yet, take a look on the blog. This collaboration from Mark and LinkTex offers insights on how to do an affordable fiber deployment with Microtech. And lastly, watch our newsletter for information about our upcoming roadmap webinar in September. It'll be September 12th at 2.30 Eastern. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for my monthly remote win box updates.